<clears throat> you what up almost didn't stream there's some really good streams going on but i said no i'm gonna fucking stream i'm gonna fucking stream even though i was very immersed in my twitch world <laughs> so uh let's do some re2 leon b Just to say it, uh, I've got opinions about current events, but I'm going to keep them to myself because I don't like to go. <laughs> I don't like to go there. <laughs> you know, it's uh, not, 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 I'm not the place for it. I've got opinions, trust me, but I, I ain't going there. I ain't going there. I ain't going there. Uh Oh, there we go. I think it might be a I think it might be slightly off the centering. If it's off, I'll fix it once the game starts. It might be a little bit off center. All right, uh Leon B. Resident Evil 2. In the midst of the T-Virus outbreak in Raccoon City, Claire Redfield succeeded in escaping from the city, along with one of the only other survivors. A young girl named Sherry. Flute! However, behind their escape... the four gifts? <laughs> ...was the lone survivor of the Shaggy, Raccoon Dirty, City Nemesis, Police and Reaper got one. Thank you, Clute. Gift in early. Appreciate it. Fuck yeah. Yeah, welcome back and thank you for the subs. Oops. Yeah, it's a little off. I can see it's a little what off. Got here? It's a tiny bit of... That's good. Don't shoot! Get down! 
We can't stay out here. Head to the police station. It'll be a lot safer. Going on. I arrived in town and the whole place went Great. insane. The radio's out. You're a cop, right? Yeah, first day on the job. Great, huh? Name's Leon Kennedy. Nice to meet you. Mine's Claire. Claire Redfield. I came to find my brother, Chris. Did you open the glove box? Sure. There's a gun inside. Better take it with you. Ah! No! Where does your tier sub go? Still in one piece. Uh, it's a tier one. <gasps> And you'll be tier one for the next 30 days, and then it'll go away. Claire! Leon! I'm okay. Head to the station. I'll meet you there. Okay. All right, Leon B. I'll probably go Mr. X every time. Probably. Unless I fuck up somewhere. Like, like if I get to an area and forgot to bring enough ammo and I can't go Mr. X because of my lack of ammo, then yeah, rip. I'll have to skip that fight, but but as long as I rem remember the fights, then I'll do all Mr. X skills. Yo, Jabo with the hundred bits. Thank you, Jabo. Appreciate it. Yeah, that took all. That, that, that took a while to load the textures. And thanks for hundred bits. Oh, the revelations. Yeah, I've I've beaten both of them. Not a fan of Revelations one. Revelations two is all right, but not really. Not really a big fan. The Revelations one I was not a fan of at all. Not a fan. I don't hate it as much as RE6, but it's not a whole lot better. Hey! Get over here! Hurry! I can't sit her down. I'll drop you a rope ladder. Grab onto it. Come on. Just a little more. Yeah. Ah. Get off me! <laughs> I saw you get from that sub to Laura earlier in Kyle's Tara. I was there. Are they some of the R games that you only play if people don't make money? There's only one game on that list, and that's RE6. RE6 is the only one behind a paywall. The others I just play when I feel like it. RE6 is the only RE game behind a paywall. Yo, DJ. Oh, hold on. Uh, monitor... I wish this option would save. It doesn't save. 
I like the brightness to be all the way up. <laughs> Man, I, I've been resisting so hard on on asking Gemini about when he thinks he'll like release the first alpha of the RE3 rebirth patch. I've been really resisting. Yesterday or the day before, he managed to get the uh, debug working. Mm, I want it so bad. <laughs> I want that fucking debug so bad. And but like, <laughs> I I don't want to ask him when he releases it because I, I don't want to be annoying. But uh, hopefully the first alpha is gonna be out soon. Because because it, it seems like he's done had some pretty good progress. Because he always does updates on Twitter. So hopefully it's soon. I gotta dish this knife ASAP. Just wasting space. This knife sucks. R2, R2 knife is garbage. I think they're both dead. The one's probably still alive. Hold on, let me check something. Give me a second. Okay, you know, yeah, Jack, I, that's what I'm doing that for. I'm just going to get rid of him. <laughs> I'm just going to get rid of him. I was looking at his logs. It's like, yeah, last time I fucking timed him out because he was extremely drunk. Now he's back being annoying again. Yeah. Uh, enough of that guy. Yeah, just annoying. <laughs> Enough of that guy. The last time was his one chance. I had a feeling it was him. I I, I recognize the the garbage. Some people just need to shut the fuck up when they drink and just watch. Some people are chill when they drink in chats and like they're not an issue, but some people when they drink and go to chats, they just are problems. And that's one of the people that just can't handle themselves when they're drinking. Clearly. Yo, Paul Pads. Some people are really chill drunks and some just aren't. It's hit or miss. Alright, let's see. Uh, Alright, let's go fight. Yeah, I want a nice, chill, comfy environment. Not... Not sloppy drunks. How I feeling today? I'm good. I'm good. I'm chilling. 
I, I almost didn't stream because I was really enjoying watching streams. Like, like there's some streams on right now that I really, that I really like to be watching, but I need to stream. <laughs> I can't just not stream. I was watching Penta and Five O Antho. Two really good roleplay streamers. It is eight twenty two PM here. Day of the week, I have no idea. But it's eight twenty two. It is Thursday, yeah. Slow bastard. Oh, not quite fast enough. I got the burps. Give me that handgun ammo. Shotty shells. I can get the shotgun when I, when I got on stairs, I believe. It's like sitting on the railing. Oh yeah, this guy. I'll kill you later with the shotgun. Only guy has a handgun right now. No, you don't. The ladder is off center. I wish they could fix that. I don't know if they can. The ladder is off center with the box it comes out of. It always irks me when I notice it. That unicorn metal. Mm. 
Dead? Yeah, you're dead. I used to, I, I used to have a ritual. Um, that I would, I would get really drunk. This was like 10 years ago. I would get really drunk. And then the next morning, I would go to Chili's. And I would get one of their salads. Ch the Chili's near me had really good salads. I forget what, what salad it was. But like, I don't know. And like, it, it was my fucking ritual. Really weird ri ritual. I would get, I would, every morning, hungover, I would go and get a salad from Chili's. And man, there were some good salads. It's like a Southwest or a Santa Fe or I, I don't know. I don't. It's it was like something something exotic. But it was a, it was a good salad. It's a good salad. And I would, I would always, I would always sit at the bar. I would never get anything alcohol-wise to drink. But I, I would always sit at the bar and eat. Always sat at the bar. But it was like 11 a.m., so I was like the only one at the bar. I wasn't like annoying drunk people who wanted to, who wanted a spot to drink your alcohol. Um, dude, I haven't been to Chili's in ages. It's been at least how long? It's been at least five years, at least. Yo, Harry. Are they both dead? up co oh you've been here but hi anyway <laughs> discard First aid spray? Fuck you. It's gonna ruin my rank. Never use first aid sprays in RE2. Unless you want a shitty ranking. But I'm pretty sure it's the same with RE3. In, R in RE1 it doesn't matter because RE1 doesn't have a ranking system. It's, it's just like time. Like, and like as, as long as you beat the game fast enough, you get the unlockables. But RE2 and 3 were a lot more advanced with requirements. Hey, Naruto. I think the four. I think tomorrow's four month anniversary for sub badges, although there's not going to be any, any new badges until six months. Six months is when the next badge unlocks. Oh! 
And look at that, four months streak. Months of disappointment later. Listen, motherfucker, at least I stream multiple times per month. Paul. <laughs> I've been subbed to Paul for like 30 months. <laughs> Streams like quarterly per year. <laughs> and, mine today. and okay, I guess today's the day then. Jack with the four months. Dude, I've been subbed to Paul for over two years, and I think I can count on like two hands how many times he's streamed. And I still sub to him. I don't know why. I don't. I don't know why, but I still do. No, I don't need to go there. Who did I watch play Layers of Fear? I think I watched Cat play it. Uh, Catastrophe. That cat. I think I watched her play it, like, when it came out. It was a cool game, but... Not- not my kind of game. I actually got it for free. Cause, uh, I think... At one point, Humble Bundle... Had a deal where you could get... Layers of Fear for free. And I ended up getting it for free at that Humble Bundle special. I've got it sitting in my Steam library, but I've just never played it. I probably will never play it, but it's sitting there. Wrong button. How did that hit the guy in the back? Was that? Is that lightning? I just saw something bright out of the corner of my eye. <laughs> like there's like a bright, like a bright ass flash. I don't know what that was. Hey, wait. I don't hear any thunder though, which is weird. Oh yeah, it is. I just heard thunder. Okay, that was lightning. I just heard some faint thunder. Ooh. 
Leon. Leon. Is that an HDR2 game? Yeah. It's an HD Maybe. mod for, yeah. the, for the GameCube, yeah. Have you seen a little girl around here? Yeah, you just missed her. Who is she? I don't know. But it's too dangerous for her to stay here alone. Leon, I'll go look for her. You go and find us a way out of here. Of course. But before I forget, here's a radio. That way we can keep in touch if something comes up. Thank you for becoming Coral. With the three months. Thank you, Coral. Saturation. Appreciate it. Thanks for the resub. So hey, hey, uh, uh, you guys want to talk about Black Lives Matter and police uh, brutality and everything else? No, me neither. Okay, cool. Thanks. No fucking interest. <laughs> Let's keep <laughs> the social events elsewhere. There's plenty of places to discuss all that. Let's be an RE channel. Going into those topics is a, an awful idea. Even though a lot of people are doing it. it causes nothing but arguments. Everyone has a side, you know. Everyone's everyone's entitled entitled to their opinion. But good lord, going into it in a setting like this is not the not the thing to do. So yeah, we're not going to do that here. We're not going to do that here. Uh, drop Maggie off. Um, I can use this now. Yeah. I'm just here to chill. I'm not trying to talk about weird shit. I mean, weird shit's okay, but not, you know, that kind of shit. Yeah, Jimmy, I played all that stuff. Origin of Species, the randomizer. Oh, yeah. Oh, come on. Played all that stuff. Multiple times. Fuck liquor. Sorry, Tar. That gives us uh, one of the plugs. I see through your lies, Tara. I see through your lies. I was there earlier, watching Kyle. All of a sudden I hear, Tarantula, thanks for the gifted sub. And I click over, and it says, Tarantula gifted sub to Laura Vanderboobin. See through your lies. Speak of the devil. <laughs> All right, uh, diamond key. No, I'll just go this way. Might as well. Oh, look at look at that. Laura wants a timeout. Uh, can someone do the honors? She redeemed her ten minute timeout. Of course, Tara did it. Surprise, surprise. Thank God timeouts don't take away VIP badges. Oof.
Hey, more. That was a little close. Nice. No damage. Took some shells, but I'll take it. I can, there's a red herb down here. You can mix it. Don't really cost me any space. Red, red herb in the next hallway, I mean. plug oh yeah it's beast scenario there's no liquor to jump through i mean he's there but he's on the other side and he doesn't bother you leaves you alone on b scenario real american I put the rights of every man. I love that song. Fucking Hulk Hogan. Naruto with the 10 gifted subs. Mandy, Hannah, Wiz, Benny, Nick, Sniper, Remo, Vulture, and Cerebral. You got a sub for the next 30 days. Congrats. Thank you, Naruto, for the 10 gifted subs. The tin bomb. Thank you, dude. I love that alert. Childhood memories. My favorite wrestler as a kid. As a teen, it was Stone Cold. But as a as a kid, definitely Hogan. I got... Yeah, I don't need all these heals. By the way, I... <laughs> I upped the difficulty of, uh, of what it takes to trigger a hype train. Because I think hype trains should be kind of special, and I felt it was too easy to trigger them. So yeah, it's... you won't see hype trains as much. Which is fine with me. I think a hype train should be special. I think I have Ric Flair's Woo as a alert. I'm not sure on what, though. Forget what alert it is. And I'm pretty sure I have Ric Flair's Woo as an alert. I don't want that.
Yeah, I, I've got Stone Colds as as multiple alerts actually. Andrew, the 300 bits. Thank you, Andrew. Appreciate it. The 300 titties. Oh, Macho Man. Yeah, Randy gave some amazing promos. That was like one of his biggest strengths. That man could talk. Great talker. Which is always a big part of a great wrestler. Because no matter how, it doesn't matter how good of a wrestler you are, when it comes to like professional wrestling, if you don't have a personality, you don't really, you're not going to go far. <laughs> Randy had a great personality and could and could talk. Mankind, yeah, mankind could talk too. Crazy son of a bitch. Brett. Yeah, Brett was... skill-wise, very, very good. Not the best on the mic, but... skill-wise, very good. Kinda average mic skills, although he shined a lot during the whole pro-Canada, anti-USA uh, storyline back in 97. Bye, Maestro, see ya. Yeah, heel heel Brett was awesome. Heel Brett was was like I thought was the best Brett. Sean, yeah, Sean Sean had it all. Sean had it all. Sean's like top top three for me. Sean. Stone Cold and Hogan. I like Silent Hill games. I like Silent Hill too. Rock is definitely top five for me. Although, I, I, I. <laughs> I really hope no one actually considers Rock the greatest of all time, because his career it wasn't didn't last long enough. That dude left for Hollywood pretty early. He didn't have a he didn't have a long enough career. But while he was there, he was amazing. Like top of the line. Booker T. Five time, five time, five time. <laughs> With the spin a Rooney. There's not. Alright, they're all dead. Cool. Wrestling is unwatchable now, in my opinion. I've like randomly tuned in here and there. It is nothing like it was. I stopped watching wrestling back in the mid... Back in like the mid-2000s, probably. 
not not too long after Cena came around, I stopped watching. Once the Cena era was a thing, I was like, yeah, it's time for me to stop. And John Cena ushered in an era that I was not a fan of. Nothing against Cena. I mean, Cena did his thing, but it's just not my, not not for my taste. I respect Cena. I just didn't like that era. Yeah, it, it got very PG with Cena. Kid friendly, PG 13. Or not even really 13. <laughs> PG. Sorry about that. When I saw the uniform, I thought you were another zombie. Who are you? What are you doing here? I'm looking for some yeah, clue. Ben. Exactly. He's it's nothing against him types. as a person. A scoop. I heard he was just not a fan of the era. Block, only there's a wrecked car barring the entrance. I've been trying to find another way inside. If we work together, we can move this thing. Give me a hand here, will you? Now, now, original Cena, when he was still in his, like, you know, rap persona, with, like, the big chains, I didn't mind that Cena, but he eventually got real, real PG, <laughs> eventually. Your boy, Ric Flair. Ada, wait! Flair should... Flair should have retired about 15 years before he did. Let me guess. You must be Ben, right? Get up! Now! What do you want? I'm trying to sleep here. Oh yeah, the one against Sean. Yeah, that retirement match or whatever it was. Is this the guy? Where like, Sean was like, I'm ben, sorry. And he's like crying. Told the city oh man, that, that would've been perfect. About what's been going on, you know, didn't you? Go out there. What did but you now tell he, him? No, he kept wrestling. And who the heck are you? Kept going. I'm trying to find my boyfriend. His name's John. He was working for a branch office of Umbrella, based in Chicago, but he suddenly disappeared six months ago. I heard a rumor that he's here in the city. I don't know anything. And even if I did, why would I want to tell you? Okay, I say we leave him in there. Does anyone know where they put the key to this cell? I have it right here, officer. But I'm not about to leave this cell. Those zombies aren't the only things crawling around out there. I hope Taker has just wow. As soon as I said Taker, like I, said, I read is Taker still I'm wrestling? Yeah, is Taker still wrestling? Get out of here before Yeah, you Taker's right still to wrestling. Me. Like once hey, a year. I'm not going anywhere. Or I'm the only twice cop a year. Left alive in this building. What? Look, if you want to live, then you're going to have to leave with me. But 
Do you he doesn't even know how to get out of the city? Uh. There's a kennel in the back of the building. Inside the kennel is a manhole. Go through and it'll lead you to the sewer entrance, but it won't be easy. All right, I'm going. He doesn't own a quit. He can't stop. And, and a lot of wrestlers do that. He just can't stop. Some wrestlers are smart. Sean quit. Although he did come back and do like a couple tag matches with Triple H like a decade later. Stone Cold knew when to quit. So it's always good when you see wrestlers quit when they should. Yeah, I, Edge should have. Edge's neck is fucked. He should not have come back. Hopefully, he doesn't get hurt. The only special I want to see is the the Jordan special. I would love to watch that. Michael Jordan. But I never watched TV, so I'd, I'd have to like find, find it online. Say what you want about Punk, but he didn't return the ring. Yet, <laughs> I'm not. I'm, I'm still. I'm still not convinced that he's not going to come back at some point. Uh, I'm. I'm not totally convinced. Oh, you almost got me. Yeah, Punk thought he was Rock Lesnar, but he realized that he wasn't. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can do wrestling and MMA. No, man, you're not Brock. <laughs> you're not a freak like Brock is. Sorry, dude. You're not a freak like Brock. Yeah, Clute, I saw that. Um, dude who played Tommy, whatever his fucking name is. I, th I think he would probably beat Punk's ass, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> yeah, Paul. It, it, uh, totally different backgrounds and skill sets. Jason David Frank, yeah, that's his name. Yes, yeah, Lover, you got it. Silva versus Connor. Isn't Silver like or isn't Silva like that's it? God, he's old as shit. <laughs> yeah, I thought Silva was retired. Didn't he like break his leg and then and then it's like he's like next fight he got knocked out. Ada. 
I don't think I've introduced myself yet. My name's Leon. I'm with the RPD. It's a dead end. You think we can get upstairs through this shaft? Give me a boost. Yeah, I'm, pr I'm, I'm pretty sure at this point in Silva's life, he'd get destroyed by Connor. Connor's not that old yet. Yeah, they didn't have a catch weight. I mean, I would watch it. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I would watch I it, but I think someone would, someone would get fucked up. I think I'll hold on to it. Oh my god, Chuck was just getting his shit rocked at the end. And it's so sad because when Chuck was in his prime, when, when he was like pure Iceman, oh, he was so beast. Chuck was a monster in his prime. Chuck was so fun to watch. Shit. Tito back in this prime. Tito Ortiz. You know, someone someone who I never hear get brought up, but someone who, who I liked a lot, who I thought was amazing, was not Ken, but Frank Shamrock. Frank Shamrock in his prime was incredible. Frank Shamrock in his prime. See Tito and Chuck rematch. Uh, I heard about it, but I don't remember the outcome. I'm guessing Tito probably won. <laughs> Since Chuck just gets knocked out these days. Yeah, I figured Tito probably beat his ass. Leona Machida. I remember when when Leoto fought Jones, and that's I think it was Jones. Didn't Leoto fight Jones and, and what's up, noob? I feel bad saying that. Didn't Leoto fight Jones? Because I kind of remember that fight and thinking, man, John Jones is incredible. <laughs> Like, w w when John was just making everyone look stupid. <sighs> John, John, John. John is like... Seriously, uh... Maybe not all time sports, but at least for MMA. And it's it's weird saying this because of, of all the accolades he has, it's it's not like he's not accomplished. Like he doesn't even have to have like the record for most type battle defenses and whatnot. He's still like even with all his accolades, he's still like the what if to me. Like like what if he kept his shit clean? It's like, man, imagine if John Jones wasn't such a fuck up. He should be, like, without a doubt, considered the best of all time. But because of his personal life. Big ass asterisk. Asterisk. I would, I would consider John the best of all time, if it wasn't for his personal life. Oh, Kimbo Slice? Well, first of all, rest in peace, Kimbo. <laughs> but yeah, Kimbo should have just stayed in the backyards. Kimbo should have stayed in the backyards. Leon, can you hear me? Ada, did 
Did you find anything? Right here. Think yeah, fast. Paul, but here's one more. Isn't it for Jones' weight class though? Doesn't he have the most title defenses for his weight class? I can't reach or am I wrong there too? I'm going to have to find another way around. Yeah, at his weight class. What? Ada, wait! Leon, come in. I found the girl, and I've cleared the wreckage that was blocking the corridor. Got it. God, I'm probably boring so many people who have no idea about fucking MMA or, or wrestling. I'm sorry, but this combo just kind of happened, and I'm like rolling with it. I'm sorry if you have no idea what the fuck we're talking about right now, but, you know, combos just happen. <laughs> so, here we are. <laughs> it, it happens. It, <laughs> these random combos is what keeps me interested in the stream. Because, it, it, trust me, it gets kind of old saying... All right, let's uh, let, let's 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 go to the item box and uh, drop this key off, and then let me let me pick this up, and then we're gonna go over here. Yeah, it's like I, I feel like a fucking robot when I'm doing that. It's like just robotic. Like it gets really old talking about Resident Evil. Maybe not for everyone, but when you when you're me, who streamed RE consistently for four plus years, it gets old talking about just Resident Evil. Ooh, Fedor. God, he was a fucking monster, man. Fedor? I'm I, I'm so mad Fedor wasn't in, like, UFC at his prime. Fedor should have been in UFC. Fader was like, Fader's punching power was scary. Fader, like, I remember watching Fader fights, and he would hit people, and like knock them out, and then I would think, how did that, how did that knock him out? Sometimes, it, it's like, like, his like light punches were like incredibly powerful. It's like, how did that knock him out? Like, it didn't look like that hard of a hit, but just because of his, his power, it, it really hurt. <laughs> I play Capcom vs. Marvel? No, I don't play fighting games. I used to when I was younger, but... Those days are long gone. I used to play, like... Uh, Soul Calibur, I used to play Tekken... Mortal Kombat... Mike Tyson. Oh man, don't get me started, and don't get, and, and don't get Paul started. Look at his fucking username, Kid Dynamite. <laughs> Mike Tyson. Mike freaking Tyson. Clute with a gifted sub to Jay. Thank you, Clute. Yeah, Mike in my eyes should have been should have gone down as the best uh at least heavyweight boxer of all time. Maybe maybe not above Ali, but you know, one or two. Man. Once uh I'm blanking on his name. Custom Auto. Right? Was it Custom Auto? Was, was that his name? Custom Auto? His, uh, trainer? His coach? Once Cus died, it's like everything went downhill. And then, like, Don King was... Fuck, fuck Don King. Fuck Don King. <laughs> fuck Don King. Ugh. 
George. Oh God, no! That was so close. Yeah, jo dude, George is amazing. George was a monster. Fucking destroyed jo Joe Frazier. Got into that fight with Ali. Got humbled. Did a couple couple more fights. Took like ten years off. Came back. Re won the heavyweight title. That is incredible. Hey Kaiser. Like who who the fuck takes ten years off and comes back and, and re re wins it? That's insane. Favorite Ari Leon, probably this one. Oh, Mayweather. I mean, he's got a he's he has an amazing record, obviously. He's fucking never lost, but I'm not really a big fan of his fighting style. It works, but... Eh. Yeah, I'm like, it's smart and it works, but it's... It's kind of boring. I wish I still had my uh, Ali collection. When I was younger, I uh, bought off the off eBay uh, 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 Ali's entire boxing career, and it was all on DVD. And I had the same thing for Tyson as well. Entire career. I wish I, I, wish I still had that. Oh, the Pac-Man fight in 2015? I didn't get to watch that, dude. I didn't get to watch that. What the fuck? Oh, he's in half. Nice, dude. I was in jail. <laughs> I didn't get to watch it. I missed the fucking... Mayweather... Pac-Man fight because I was in fucking jail. Hey, Reckless. Back in the days, when, back in the days when I was being a, being an idiot. I missed it because I was in jail. Fucking rip. If you were to be in me, wouldn't Pac-Man? Yeah, I don't really, I don't really know anyone else who could have. At that weight class. I was listening to it on the radio. Because, you know, you can buy... You can buy radios in jail. So I, I was listening to it on the radio. Thankfully, that... We had a station that was giving us updates. And <laughs> everyone was going nuts when I was like, yeah, Floyd one, Floyd one. Clute with a gifted sub. Thank you, Clute. Yeah, Harry, I agree. I agree. I agree. Wasn't really quite in his peak prime. Um, I'm not a fan of Mayweather 
very much. But there was one fight of his I watched that did, that was really impressive. Like, it was a boxing clinic. For anyone who who's seen Floyd, May Floyd Mayweather Jr. against Arturo Gotti, that was just a, a slaughtering. Mayweather slaughtered Gotti. Rest in peace, Gotti, by the way. Oh, he beat Hatton's ass as well. Well, I specifically re remember the Gotti fight. It was really bad. It was real bad. Probably, Paul. I'm convinced that, like, once MMA came around, all all the people that would have been elite fighters in boxing went to MMA. <laughs> like, if it wasn't for, for MMA coming around, <clears throat> those guys that are beasts in fucking MMA would have probably been beasts in boxing. I get the idea that Vince would have fucked it up. Something tells me Vince would have fucked it up. I think if, if Vince had bought UFC early on, he would have fucked it up. Like, he would have tried to add too much to it. And not, and not just let it be what it is. I mean, like Vince is if Vince is good, Vince is good at what he's good at. You know, he's good at one thing. Everything else, he's not so good at. Uh, I need to go upstairs to Iron's office. That's crazy, Paul. Profit.
Thank you for coming. Yo, Pudge. Double O, motherfucking seven. Saturation. With the three month resub. Can yeah, a yeah. mod give Pudge a shout out, please? He streams here on you on Twitch and YouTube. Thank you, Pudge. Hope you've been well. Uh oh. Mr. Dag with the hundred bits. Thank you. The biddies, dude. Appreciate it. So, Pudge, uh, do you got plans for Last of Us Part Two when it drops? Are you are, are you going in like I am? You are good shit. Yeah, I can't. I can't fucking wait, man. It's getting close. It's getting close, man. It's getting so close. I'm. I'm pretty hyped for it. I am way more hyped for Last of Us Part Two than I was for RE3. Way more hyped. Oh yeah, yeah, much. I, I've read all the spoilers. I've watched all the spoilers. I've seen. I've seen it all. Even still, I'm I'm hyped. Yeah, I, I'm still hyped. Holy shit! I think he, he must have got caught on the corner. Surprised I was able to. Do that without taking damage. Yeah, I'm, I'm still like the shit, dude. Did you change your username, Pudge? Didn't you have like underscores? You did. Are those O's now? Okay. I was like, I was like, something about your username is different. It looks better. Fuck them underscores. <laughs> yeah, it's, it looks better. All right. Um, combine. Pudge. If the day ever comes where you're a partner, I'm sure. You, I'm sure you can probably. Yoink that username. Because if I ever become a partner, I think I might become just Wesker. Because the person who has the Wesker username is like non-existent, pretty much. Yeah, it seems like Wow. It seems it seems like Twitch isn't really willing to help you out with getting those names unless you're a partner. So I'm definitely gonna try to yoink Wesker if I can. Thank you, Pudge. I applied for partner like three times, but my my viewership isn't consistent enough. It sucks. There's days where I, I don't hit 75, and that's what fucking kills me. That's what makes Switch say no. It's it's like it's like some days like like my last stream. I, I don't look at viewer accounts, but my last stream, apparently, I had like 142 viewers, which is like fucking more than enough. But then some days I'll have like 60 viewers. It's like, oh my god, I'll never get partnered with my viewer with my viewer account fluctuating. Fluctuating viewer accounts is what like 
Twitch looks at. Oh yeah, yeah, there, there's plenty of partners I see that have like 20 viewers. So it's like, how the hell did you get partner? Hey, stars member. Yeah, you caught me. And I and I'll be live again tomorrow. Probably probably tomorrow afternoon. All good, Pudge. Thanks for uh, dropping by. Thanks for the reset. Good to see you as always, man. Yeah, that sexy green check mark. I think six month badge is a yellow check mark. Oh, we got a couple months to go for for that uh starts rolling in. Still have your DC Douglas cameo where you have. Yeah, um, whenever someone becomes a sub, like, like it's whenever there's a new sub, it plays the, the DC cameo. Even though it says member and not sub. Because I had it made for when back back when I was still on YouTube. Get away! But uh, close enough. No. Now the actual cameo video, I don't think I have anymore. I'm pretty sure that was on my old PC. Man, I didn't save it. But I've got the audio for it. Ben! Can you still hear me? Come on, answer! Damn! I don't believe this. I almost got the story. <laughs> ben. Uh, <laughs> bitter irony. The chief of police, a co conspirator. Get that scum. Make him pay. Hang in there, Ben. Leon. Shit. Tabbed out. Hold on. Where are you going, Ada? To the chemical plant. I have a feeling that's where I'll find John. Ada! Wait! Hey! Leon, are you still there? We're leaving. Are you crazy? The streets are still crawling with zombies. It'll be all right, trust me. We found a way to the sewer. Follow us later. Claire! Claire! Wait, wait! Man, why doesn't anyone ever listen to me? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I followed this uh, Twitch account called uh, Streamer Bands. It's just at Streamer Bands. S-T-R-E-A-M-E-R. B A N S. It tells you whenever a Twitch partner gets banned. Uh, a Twitch partner got banned, and then two minutes and fourteen seconds later, 
They were unbanned. I guess that was a mistake. Two minute ban. Guess that was a whoops from uh, Twitch aside. Okay, I think... I'm just gonna go ahead and assume that I fucked up. Because I'm pretty sure I missed the plug in the library. Pretty sure I didn't get that plug. I'm on the yeah, like I think I went in there and didn't have any spaces, so I just left. I was out of space. Fucking inventory management fails. Outside. I feel like going outside. No one's out here? Oh, these guys. Hey, Brad. Poster boy, no. <laughs> yeah. He's on the poster in RE2 and 3. And Brad is the asshole who bit Marvin. As we learn in RE3 Remake. It was Brad's fault. If it wasn't for Brad, Marvin would have been okay. Or died to a different zombie. Well, not died. Changed because of a different zombie. Yeah, they, they, they should they should have just let Nemesis face fuck him. Like in the original. Just let him get- just let him get skull fucked. But no, they had to change it. Yo, Juice, what up, dude? Talking about Brad? Yeah, we're talking about Brad. Brad's death in OG RE3 compared to Brad's death in RE3 Remake. I was right, I did forget it. Yeah, 
Oh, do I have any heals? I do. Yeah, nostalgia is in the past. You can't you can't remake that. Okay, um, think, 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 library, I can go this way. My opinion on, on, on RE3 is pretty similar to my opinion on, on RE7. <clears throat> I thought the first half was good. And then the second half, they just like failed. Because RE7, I love the first half, and then the second half, they, they just like... Just didn't go in the right direction. Yep, I never did this puzzle. Okay, all four plugs. Damn, I never got that herb either. Wesker with the hundred bits. Thank you, Wesker. Oh shit, I could have gone to the third floor. And just took the uh, shoot. Shortcut. Two and RE3 remake paled in comparison to the hype that RE that RE7 had. RE7 blew two and three out of the water, hype-wise. 
But also, what I think needs to be considered is the time the time in between seven and the previous RE coming out. It was several years. Since seven, we've gotten two games, and seven came out three years ago. Like, Capcom is pumping out RE games mainline RE games a lot more often than that they were. Yeah, and apparently RE3 is not getting any DLC. I mean, it's, I guess it's just rumors. I don't know how true it is, but apparently there's no DLC for it. Which I believe because it's been out for two months now and there is no DLC yet. So yeah, they just, they gave us that and said, fuck off. <laughs> well, yeah, that's it. There it is. Get out of here, Birkin. I said it last stream. I'm only go I'm probably only going to play Ari the Remake. If like really cool mods come out for it. Like, if something, like, really cool comes out for it, I'll probably play it mod-wise. But just, like, vanilla playthroughs of Arthur Remake, I don't see a point in it. It's not really that good of a game. Ada. Doesn't really warrant more playthroughs. What was that all about? Running off like that was reckless and stupid. Those zombies are everywhere. Not to mention that thing that got banned. I played it for like a good week when it came out. It was like a solid week. Look, Ada, I beat the game on all officer, difficulties. My job and yeah, you. that's. But we're not going to get through this alive. If that we was it for me. Together, okay. I don't really. <laughs> right. Didn't really have the urge to play it anymore. A week uh, after a week, I was good. A week was plenty. Really reckless. I mean, I don't blame you, but... Damn. Okay, this is a decent place to take a quick bathroom break, so enjoy the save room theme. Because this theme is beautiful. And I'll be back in like two minutes or so.
Okay, listen. <clears throat> I forgot that the GameCube version pauses automatically after after a certain amount of time. Not my fault. The GameCube version automatically pauses after a certain amount of time. Yo, Vlad with the three. Thank you, Vlad. Appreciate the three dollar dono. Are we doing all right? South handle. Coral with a hundred bits. Take a coral. When I went out there to go to the bathroom, I was informed that there's General Cho's chicken waiting for me. Whenever I finish the stream. Do I have a sub goal? Yeah, I do. More subs. <laughs> That's my sub goal. My sub goal is more subs. That is always the goal. Short stream. I mean, I'm gonna finish the game. A, I would call that a typical stream. Do a playthrough and. Harry with the 500 bits. Thank you, dude. Why don't bid badges show? I swear, no one's. Barely anyone's bid badges show on my channel. What the fuck? <laughs> There's I love the emote and like barely anyone has it because it's a tier two emote. The the Wesker drink emote, it's so good and it's actually a natural ice can. It's beautiful. Yeah, be likable. And have good luck. Leon, that woman was... I have to talk to her. I would have twice as many subs if I actually, like, streamed every day and did long hours, but I just don't have it in me. <laughs> I don't have it in me. I used to, but whatever. Yo, Kit with the with the uh, raid. Thank you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Appreciate it. I used to, I used to stream for twelve plus hours every day. Back in twenty sixteen, I was a beast. Like the OGs of the OGs remember those days. There aren't barely anyone any of those left, but back in twenty sixteen and like Early 2017, I used to be a fucking streaming monster, but eventually you just get burnt out. You can't do that shit forever. <laughs> Rumex with the five dollars. Thank you, Rumex. Yeah, like when I was still building, 
identified. In that building phase of like trying to get on the map, I, I grinded Ada, hard. Ada I grinded Wong. real hard. Ada Wong. I've heard that name before. Now I remember. One of the men from Chicago who came to assist the T-Virus research used his girlfriend's name as his password. Ada and John. I if you don't grind hard in the know? beginning, who are you? you you're not going to get anywhere. Annette Birkin. You got to grind real hard. The man responsible for the creation and then like once you have a following, you can kind of coast, happens. honestly. What? John's dead. And that's kind of what I did. I grinded real hard. And then once I had like a following, yeah, I went into like coast mode. You will be joining him shortly. I won't let anyone take the G-Virus away from me. G-Virus? It's capable of creating the ultimate bioweapon. Its potential is even greater than that of the T-Virus. Then that must mean the creature in the police department is... Precisely... My husband, William. And it's all Umbrella's fault. None of this would have happened if they hadn't tried to steal his research away from him. Any infamous person I remember? Where what did do you, you mean? get that? What, what do you mean infamous? It looks exactly like the one I gave Sherry. She dropped it. I've been holding on to it for her. Liar! Give it back to me! <laughs> Infamous. Well, if we want to go infamous in a bad Too way, bad. Susie Lou. I'm sure some of you. I'm sure some of you have heard of her. <laughs> Susie Lou. I remember I Susie. <laughs> I'm not gonna talk much on it because I don't I don't wanna I don't wanna start this beef. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> yeah. Susie, I remember like three years ago. Susie came to my stream. Because she's a Resident Evil fan. And of course I knew her, because like she's popular. And she was there for a few minutes. And then after a few minutes, she proceeded to tell me how to run my channel. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you got too many mods, or I don't remember exactly what she told me. I think I think it was probably that you got too many mods. And at that point, I honestly did. I did honestly have too many mods at that point. But for someone who's first time in the stream, it's like who the fuck comes to a stream and says you got too many mods? Like who the fuck does that? And like she was like established, like she already had like Ada? It, like at least fifty k of subs by then. Like she wasn't as big as she is now, but you know she was, you know, a lot bigger than me. You know, tell me how to <laughs> tell me how to run my channel, and she had literally been there for fucking like five or ten minutes. Pretty pretty soon afterwards, I. Under and blocked her on social media. And yes, she was right. I did have too many mods, but it but it wasn't her place to say it. You know, it wasn't her place to say it. What really did it in? Oh my god, what I remember what did it in. When I when oh man. When I had the PewDiePie video and, and she talked shit on on her social media. The fucking PewDiePie video.
I should really watch what I say. I, I should not go into it too much. I actually should stop right now. Never mind. Never mind. Anyway. All right. Let's, uh, let's, <laughs> let's, let's use this. <laughs> let's use this valve. Nice, the valve worked. Awesome. Is the valve gonna work here too? Oh, it did. <laughs> I know, isn't that valve so nice, Reckless? I love that valve. It's so cool. What a nice valve. I didn't mean to pick that up. I meant to pick this up. Gator fight? Nah, no, this is Leon B. Gator isn't going to be there. Half was gone. Is that the first time I noticed it? Dude, Ada doesn't have a lower half. I should I should screenshot that and send it to them. Pretty sure it's not supposed to be like that. She has no lower half. I need to screenshot that. All right. Leon. This bullet wound isn't making things any easier. Quiet, Leon. I'll patch you up. I will send that to... That's too Either K.O. or Mo Artist as a possible bug report. I just found out. John's dead. What? Two of the people that, that made this, I Let's just get out of know here. on social media. The sooner the better. If it's intended to be like that, then oh well, but I'll at least send it. Is that, that's the first time I ever noticed it. That whole, um, infamous thing that Jack brought up, 
got me thinking of like popular people that I've seen in smaller channels. Um, I remember one day I was watching Distortion 2. And now, Dist by no means is, is a small channel. Dist at the time had over 100,000 followers. He's not a small channel. But by comparison to who came into his chat, he was very small. It was it was shortly after R2 Remake came out. And I was chilling watching Dist run R2 Remake. Yeah, Paul. <laughs> so, so, Summit 1G. It's like, sup dude? In chat. To, uh, like, Summit was there. And holy shit, dude. Summit is royalty. If you don't know, if, if you don't know who Summit 1G is, uh, you clearly don't know much about Twitch. Summit is is a god. And Summit came in chat. I don't know how just kept his fucking composure. I would have I would have flipped shit. But just stayed very calm. And Summit was like, you know, just asking some questions because at, at that point in time, Summit was interested in speedrunning RE2 remake. Because he liked it a lot. It's like, it's like, damn, dude, Summit's here? I could imagine Summit, like, randomly... Ro I cannot imagine Summit randomly coming to my stream. And just... No, dude. That is way too big, way too big of a streamer. To just, like, drop in. And, like, it wasn't just, like, a raid. It's like, he actually... He actually hung out. He actually hung out. Talking in chat is like, what the fuck? Oh yeah, Paul. I remember that too. I was really drunk. I was really drunk. It was a bad time for Paul to come in. Is great. Falk will always be my favorite horror streamer, no matter what. Falk is the total package. Like streamer wise, like he he provides everything that you'd want as a streamer, which is kind of like um Enigma is kind of has everything as well. Ada, thank you so much. Shoddy parts.
Come on, Ada. Good lord, Coral. Are you drunk? Or is your typing just awful? <laughs> that was a... That was a mess of words right there, dude. Ada, I need you to do this for me. No, you get in front of me. Thank you. God, Ada's so much better than Cherry. <laughs> Holy shit. You can have A to do that. We finally arrived. There must be something hidden here. She has unlimited ammo. It, it, it's like a hack. It's like I can cheat without cheating. She has unlimited ammo. She can just keep shooting. Shoddy shells I have. Yeah, I don't, I don't consider it cheating. <laughs> as long as the NPC is cheating for me. That's my thought process. Sub the box. Curious. I think Bach is streaming. Yeah, he is. Playing code Veronica. I've been sub to Bach for 40 months. <laughs> that is by far my longest sub. 40 months. I had 41 months and 12 days. 40 months. Long ass time. Hmm, what's on TV? Six. 
Really? I was the first streamer? I was your first streamer? Are you serious? Damn. I had no idea I was your first. I popped your streamer, Sherry? Damn. Lord Rage popped my streamer, Sherry. Lord, Lord Rage was my first streamer. He was playing RE2. Kind of funny I'm playing RE2. And he was playing as Leon. I'm not, I don't know if it was A or B, but he's playing as Leon. RE2. I was your first too, Reckless? That's crazy. It's always, it's always wild to think that I was people's first streaming experience. Really silver. What the fuck? Who? Okay, now don't lie. Now for people, now, now if you don't, if you don't like to chat, that's fine. You gotta say anything. Who here was I their first stream? Like, for the people whose first stream is me, say something. If you, if you don't like to chat, that's fine. Yeah, mine was Lord Rage. Back in December of 2015. You worked for Rage, you got sloppy seconds. I mean, hey, Rage was like the god. I don't, I don't fucking... R Rage was my first, and then Sniper got six was my second. You, Laura, sorry for your pressure, you into joining streams. I, I remember those days where, like, you weren't really around yet, but yeah, I, I remember that. I remember that. I remember. That's wild, dude. And, like, what's even more wild is, like, people that I inspired to stream. Which is even crazier. Because, like, there's some people who started streaming because of me. Which is insane. Come on, let's go. I oh I cause a rando. Yeah, me and J Rock were like, honestly, me and J Rock did more randos of RE One remake than anyone. Me and Ran me and J Rock were like the RE One rando gods. Yeah, Paul's a Paul's a streamer, by the way. Paul always streams. Second stream we saw is landing a perma band. All Vax, you were kind of a dickhead back then. <laughs> I don't blame them. <laughs> Ada, Ada, I didn't, I didn't ban you, Come but on, snap out you, of it. you, you, you definitely pissed me off one day. <laughs> I didn't ban you, but you did piss me off one day. You were kind of a dick. Th thank God you chilled the fuck out. <laughs> but you were a dick back then. You were a dick back then. Too shy to talk. Yeah, I think everyone's like that at first. Like you, like you, you kind of feel it out, get like a vibe, and then start chatting.
Oh, it's B, that's right, he jumps. Talking tough? You weren't talking tough, you were... too invasive. You were like... <laughs> Especially with who you... Especially with who you were being invasive with. Of all people, it was Raven Rose. <laughs> of all people, the legend Raven Rose. But yeah, nah. It's all good. You you worked your shit out. You're chill now. Welcome back. Hey, take it easy. We're inside Umbrella's secret lab. I'll go find something to treat that wound, so just rest here in the meantime. But... I'll only slow you down with these injuries. Go... save yourself. Is it just me, or does everybody always ignore what I say? I told you, it's my job to look after you. But... you'll be in danger if you stay with me. I know I've only known you for a short period of time, but I really enjoy being with you. I... I know, I'm not capable of caring about anyone, but I don't want to lose Yeah, Raven was Raven nice, Raven was nice to everyone. Wait here for me, I'll be right back. She was a very nice, charitable person. Um... She was just, she was great. It, it sucks that she didn't... Make it to see Last of Us Part 2. It sucks she didn't make it to see Part 2. Because she loved Last of Us. That was like her passion. Sucks she didn't make, she didn't make it to see it. Hashtag fuck cancer. Can cancer took her. Was there one of my first mods? She was in my very first stream. She was she was there day one. Yeah, Raven was a mod day one. She was a day one supporter. I met Raven because she was a mod for Lord Rage, who was the first streamer I watched. And then when I became a streamer, she was watching my streams. Yo, Vengeful. Well, Andrew, you're still a mod, so I guess you did a good job. <laughs> you did good, Andrew. You did good. Shoddy shells? Fuck yeah. Let's go. No. All, all my mods are great. Honestly. And I'm not just saying that, like... Everyone that I have modded now... I, I trust completely. You know, with the well-being of my channel. Except Saf, yeah. Except Saf. And I'm sure you and, and I'm sure you said that because Saf was like just here, but then he left. <laughs> because you probably have it on mod view, so you saw Saf is here.
Oh my god, come on. This dumb shit. That Laura, that is one thing I wish was a, was possible. It's one of the very few things that Twi that YouTube has that Twitch doesn't. I would love to be able to retract a message on Twitch because there's some, there's sometimes where I, where I say something that I typed too quickly or that I didn't mean or that I said in the wrong chat because I've got like four windows open. Uh <laughs> yeah. I I did that one the other day. Had like four windows open. I meant to say it in one chat. Said it in, in another. It's like, oh god. That was a weird thing to say randomly. And the the chat that wasn't intended for. Awkward. Time out for last was part two. I am more and more excited every single day. I don't get excited for much, honestly. But Last of Us, very excited. Because the first one is okay, my death reception is shit apparently. I didn't think he was that close. But yeah, I'm very excited. Let's just put it like this. I'm more excited for Last of Us Part 2 than I was for RE3 Remake, RE2 Remake, and RE7. Because Last of Us Part 1 had a humongous impact on me. It's the last game that, like, that, that I... Okay, hold on, let's see. There's two games in the last ten years that I, I, that I, like, felt. You know? Like, like, physically, like, had, like, a... Like, an emotional reaction to. Um... The Last of Us. And... Red Dead Redemption Two. Those are like th those are the two games that got me like emotional because they were that good. RDR Two and and The Last of Us. I'm glad you fucking came around. Not everyone comes around. That's the thing. Some people stay in their ways. I I'm glad that you became a better person. Oh, um, Henry and 
and Sam. Sam was the was the kid, and then Henry was the big brother. Yeah, Henry and Sam and Last of Us. Sam got bit and became his and affected, and then he killed his brother, and then through the grief, Henry shot himself. Last of Us only got me in, in one place, and it was during the um, ranch house scene, where Ellie finally, where Ellie finally like confronted Joel about Sarah, his daughter. That whole conversation, oh my god, that combo fucked me up. That combo fucked me up. I played Dead Aim. No, I never played Dead Aim. The game looked like shit, so I didn't bother playing it. See, okay, that the intro. Okay, I I get why people cried. Okay, I, I get it, I get it. All right, but I didn't cry. And this is why I didn't cry. Because it was at the it, because it was at the beginning of the game. It was at like literally the in, the the intro. Therefore, I had no chance to grow an attachment to Sarah. Therefore, I wasn't sad. I mean, like yes, it was a sad thing, but I mean, how am I supposed to grow an attachment to Sarah after ten minutes? If she had died later in the game, yeah, it would have fucked me up, but it, it was in the intro. I, I, I can't get emotional about someone dying when I don't know their character. But, but like, she, she died, like, pretty much immediately. That's why the intro didn't get me, because... It was, it was a character that I, that I didn't have the opportunity to get attached to. It's a child dying, which which is most people's thing. But it's a child dying. Yeah, I get it. But I'm not a parent. I don't I don't have that like parental instinct. Sorry, I don't have that. I, I'm not a dad. If I was a dad, I could see crying there, but I, I'm I'm not a dad. <laughs> Substatic. Gotta get to another person first? Yes. Yes. I can't get too sad about someone when I don't know them. I just can't. If I don't know you, how the fuck am I supposed to be sad about you? Speaking of saddening, you know what's really sad? The fact that I need to open another beer right now. 
The, f the fact that I, yeah, hold on. Okay. You watch BB tonight? Well, what do you mean? BB? Whenever I see BB, I think Big Boss. Like Big Boss Incarnate. Can I watch him tonight? You want me to be totally honest? I don't watch Big Boss. I sub to him, and I'll always sub to him. But I don't watch him. I don't watch- I don't watch Big Boss, I don't watch... Pudge... I don't watch any of those people. I don't- <laughs> I don't watch... Geeky. I sub to them, and I support them. But I don't watch them. I will always sub to them, though. Because I- because I, I do support them. The only thing I watch on Twitch is GTA Roleplay. And they don't play GTA Roleplay. The only thing I watch is GTA Roleplay. What about Sleepy T? No, because he doesn't do GTA Roleplay. I, I don't watch horror streams. All I watch is GTA Roleplay. If it ain't RP, I ain't watching. Milton? Milton T. Pike? Like, who plays Kiki? Yeah, yeah, I uh, follow Milton. Yep, I have been following Milton since March of last year. You like it better now that I'm on Twitch? I like it better now that I'm on Twitch too. <laughs> Trust me. Like, I did take a viewership plunge coming over here, but the support went up. So it's fine. I don't, I don't get as many viewers as I did on YouTube, but the support went up. So it's, it's cool. It's all good. Because I... On YouTube, I pretty much topped out around 250 members. Which, if you're, if, if you're like, if you don't know about YouTube, a YouTube member is the same as a Twitch sub. Look at my sub count. I'm at 475. That's... That's 225 more than I ever had on YouTube. So yeah, I'll take the uh, viewership plunge. <laughs> it's fine. All good. Yeah, gifting is the main thing. Honestly, gifting is the difference. Hey, Vinny. Gifting is the main thing. Rights of every man. Yo, Harry with the tin gifted. <laughs> Thank you, Harry. <laughs> Harry showing the difference between Twitch and YouTube. You can't do that on YouTube. You can do that here, though. Harry just threw 10 subs 
at random motherfucking people. <laughs> like, that's that's the difference. That's the difference. That's the difference. Huge difference. Thank you so much, Harry, for the 10 gifted. Harry is one sub away from 50 total. If I was Harry, that would annoy the fuck out of me. <laughs> Harry's at 49 gifted. That would annoy the dog shit out of me. Static with the 100 bits. Thank you, Static. I appreciate it. <laughs> I guess Harry isn't as OCD as I am. Because that would annoy this shit out of me. But yeah, thank you, Harry. Man, thanks, Static. Very much. And yes, I will be live tomorrow. It'll probably be tomorrow afternoon. Possibly morning. Probably not, though. P probably in the afternoon. But yeah, we'll, we'll be live again tomorrow. It won't be as- it will, it will not be as late as today. I promise you that. It'll definitely be earlier. Alright, um, power room key. That's this way. I need the mash key to do that. Whoops. Fifteen to go. Oh, for five hundred subs. True. I didn't even realize you. that. Yeah, fifteen subs away from five hundred. My husband. I know what you're looking for. You came for the well, uh, <laughs> didn't you? My kid is tomorrow. Take it from me. Unless tomorrow's this like a big sub drop day. Legacy. I'm not sure what no. happened Where's that last month on tomorrow's date. With you know who I'm talking about. What? You really don't know anything, do you? <laughs> You're so gullible. She's one of the operatives sent here by the agency. And why she came here is to obtain the G-Virus. That's a lie. No, it's the truth. I discovered this when I did a background check on her. She specifically got close to John and became his girlfriend to get information about him. That can't be. I know her. Ada wouldn't do something like that. If you don't want to believe it, I don't really care. You're about to die anyway. No, sir. You bitch. <laughs> this happens every single playthrough. Look at how much ammo I have. Got... 64 magnum rounds.
every single time. I always conserve for no reason. Oh, I'm fucking coming. Oh, I'm fucking coming. Yo, Halvax with the tier three for three months. <laughs> I love that alert. <laughs> that, alert is, that, that alert is lewd as fuck. <laughs> Thank you, Halvax, for the three months at tier three. Thank you, dude. Is R2 N64 the same as PS1 game? No. There's differences. R2 N64 gives you the option to have different blood color. Uh, there's a randomizer. It's not a big randomizer, but it lets you randomize like ammo and heals. Uh, Ada. No. It's different. Jack, that emote is fucking disgusting. That ugly ass bot forehead emote. It is such an ugly emote. <laughs> Someone in Box Discord made that. I I saw when they made it. I was like, oh my god, that is disgusting. That is a disgusting emote. Bockhead. It's a modified forehead emote. Leon, you made it. Claire, is that you? Where are you? But never mind that right now. Leon, you have to go back and get Sherry for me. I left her in the security office. Please, you must save her. Wait a second. What are you gonna do? Where are you going? I still have a few loose ends to take care of. I'm counting on you. Hello? Claire, are you there? Claire! The security office? The security office? Watch. I'm gonna show you- I'm gonna show you some OP shit. Look at this. I am the only person on the fa on the face of the earth, other than Bach himself, who has this emote. With the one that's put in chat, I'm the only one who has it. Just me. I had that emote. <laughs> Shit. Uh, I forgot. There go back.
Yeah, that's the 800... That's the 800,000 bit emote. Eight hundred thousand bits. If you don't know the math, that is eight thousand dollars. I've got an eight thousand dollar bit badge. Getting into play buttons? No, 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 no. You don't, you, you don't get YouTube play buttons until you hit a hundred thousand subs. The first YouTube play button is a hundred thousand subs. sharing. I think that's my first 10,000 bit dono. And of course it's all Vax. Hallvax with the 10,000 bits. For anyone who doesn't know, that's a hundred bucks. Hallvax with the 10,000 bit donation. This fucking guy. Hundred dollars. Holy shit. Hallvax, thank you for adding on to your already immense donation total. Paul Vax was already my top donator of all time, and he is only adding on to it. <laughs> only adding on to the immense totals. <laughs> he is adding on to his crown. His dick just grew by one entire inch. His penis is now 37 inches. I'll be keeping track. He has a 37 inch penis. I don't know what that is in meters, but in inches, it's 37. Sherry? I've come to get you out of here. Claire is waiting for you. Good lord. Thank you, all that. <laughs> you're, you're, you're a fucking beast. Thank you, dude. God damn. Ninety three centimeters. There we go. You can't see Holvax. Well, his name in chat is Noxian Scion, but his name on YouTube was Holvax. I, I still call him as Hol I, I still call him by his YouTube name, but on Twitch, on Twitch he's Noxian. I prefer to keep calling him by his YouTube name. Just 
rest here for now. Claire should be back soon. Yes, enormous wiener. Oh god, I gotta pee. We gotta hurry this up. It just hit me. I need to pee pretty bad. Oh yeah, and, and when you hit that 10k bit badge, you unlock a 10k bit badge emote. Forgot about that. Forgot about that one. What's the emote? Uh, the one that Halvax just used. The... The Wesker Nemesis Pepe emote. Smart sometimes. Well, judging by that, the pagan looking ass ball cat emote. Good lord, I'm not surprised. <laughs> that fucking emote is just ugly as shit. But that's what it's intended as. It was intended as an ugly emote. about me section it's a bit that's a basic ass question i got an about me section for a reason for basic questions like that Get out the way. I was on bladder today. Well, I only peed once during the stream, so better than usual, I guess. 
Although, I do gotta go pee pretty bad right now. But it can wait till the stream ends. Still the gift king to 139. I have the antidote. Thank you, Andrew. And congrats. The five of you that got subs. You're now a sub for the next 30 days. After that, it will fall it'll fall off. But you can continue the sub if you like content. Yeah, free trial preview for the next month. You're gonna be okay. Thank you, Andrew. Tomorrow we get to 500? It's over. Uh, it depends. What if tomorrow is one of those days where I drop like 70 subs? <laughs> I don't know. Hopefully. Because there, there are those random days where I I dropped like 70 subs because people went crazy, you know, last month. Yeah, hopefully 500 subs tomorrow. Unless a ton of subs were gifted tomorrow, last month. We'll see what happens. What was that? What was that? Warning. Biohazardous outbreak imminent. The emergency system has been activated. This train will detonate. Repeat, this train will detonate. What's wrong? I don't know. The door won't open. Gemini. Gemini. Can it can, can I annoy you for a second? I'm drinking, so I wanna I wanna annoy you for a second. I, I've got one question. If you don't want to answer it, that's fine. Can I annoy you for one second? What is it? Okay, listen. No rush. No rush. But I'm really curious. When do you think? the first build is going to release for for that patch. I'm really curious. <laughs> I'm really curious. <laughs> like like the first alpha release of that patch. Let me drag your ass onto fixing bugs. Okay. I didn't want to ask you because I don't want to like annoy you. But man, I'm curious. <laughs> I want to try it out. Somewhere near July. Okay. Okay. That's all, that's all I was wondering about. I mean, in the end, all that really matters to me is that it's out in time for whenever Kamizo finishes Origin of Species RE3. I mean, yes, Gemini, obviously. I fucking love debug menus. I'm a debug menu whore.
<laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. I'll see if I can find someone to raid after I get back from the bathroom. BRB. Warning. But yes, Warning. if you're leaving now, thanks for watching. Drop a follow if you haven't. I stream Resident Evil all the time. Oh, no. But yeah, BRB. It's finally over. Sherry, you look terrible. No worse than you, Claire. Come on, time to leave. Now? What's wrong? Is something following us? We have to go. We don't have any time to waste. Go? Where? Hey, it's up to us to take out Umbrella. <laughs>
All right. <clears throat> A, a rank, I'll take it. All right, raid channel. Is it true? Is what I heard true? Oh my god. He's not even playing Resident Evil. He's not even playing Resident Evil. <clears throat> Whatever, I'll raid him anyway. This is like against my rules though. I, I usually only rate people who play Resident Evil, but he fucking never streams, so I I'll take what I can get. Alright, Paul is streaming. Kid Dynamite. The son of a bitch rarely rarely streams. Sadly's not sadly's not Resident Evil. He's playing uh Final Fantasy VI. Alright. Normally he plays RE2. He's he he loves RE2. So if you're an RE fan, you know, give him a follow. It's normally not Final Fantasy. It's normally like it's normally Resident Evil. But yeah. Show Paul some love. He's a good guy. But yeah, I'll be back uh tomorrow morning with uh some more RE. But yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. Ton of support today. Y'all are amazing. Yeah. Thank you. And see you in the morning. Bye.